Hello and welcome back to The Sims 4. And today is the day we are finally doing some renovation. I just want them to wake up so we can actually do something. Because otherwise, well, be in trouble. I don't want to remove their bedroom if they are still asleep. So that's the goal at least. We're all waking at the same time, which might be a problem. So let me, hold on, we have to figure things out. You need to go here right now, like high priority. You, st stop it, stop it. <laughs> I don't want that. And then after you do that, you will sort this out and maybe we, well, you know what? Mm, I'm, I'm just wondering if they're not doing anything. Just you all hanging there. All right, let's pause the game. Let's go from here and let's figure this out. So what we are doing today, we are well, renovating this house, a surprise. We do have some space in here. Let's take a look at how this all looks like for, for us at the moment. So this is our little house. We have a pretty nice land in here. I feel like we can extend it sideways and have like a nice garden at the back. Uh, I don't know if I'll do the garden right now, but that at least that's the idea. But what I'll do, I'll take um, advantage of the pre-made rooms and then I'll use that as a baseline for whatever we do next. So I want to see as well where this should go because I want to leave some space in the front of the house so I can place it. That'll be one thing. Now, this, can I move the whole room? Like, for example, you. You, for example. If I bring this, I'm just bringing the wall if I do that. Move. Yeah, that's... There we go. We can move it. So, this one will go there. This one will go there. Just for me to know and see what we have in here. Oh. This would be like Tetris. All right. Oh, we have this one that I want to keep, that I think we will use. And then our kitchen. Can I sell everything in that room? Like, for example, if I move... Oh, I can sell everything. All right. So we'll start there. Now, we do have some... Let's look just at kitchens. I have this which is a rustic style it's okay i guess but not something that i'm looking to use the victorian style no we also have no power no problem kitchen <laughs> no thank you i think i'll go for this one and then we'll style this i i like the red one i think i'll go for the red That'll look pretty cool, actually. So if I buy this room... I have to remember how to rotate things. Sorry. There we go. So how do we want this? We have a fridge over there. I'm just thinking about where would the door be to this room. And I'm thinking I will add this right there so we have more space as well now this is still a little bit tight i believe i want this to be a little bit wider and i don't think we need more in here i'll add an, an extra room over there and to be honest i'll actually sell this as well so we get that money back and we can play around with everything that we have. 
So in this area, do I have like a dinner dining room? There we go. Maybe we should go with the modern style. Although this one is quite good as well. I really like it. For inspiration, I think that'll be the one. And then, well, this will have to fit right here somehow. Like if I do it over there, then, oh, look at that. So much light in there. And then I want to remove this wall. Is that possible? I think we do have a, a tool for a wall, but I'll take a look at that later. So we have the basics in here. What do we also need? Well, a living room, right? So for the living room, we are going with this one. And oh, there are some options in here. Should we use one that goes very close like decoration to the kitchen or that'll be too much maybe that's a little bit too much what are the other options we have no oh this one's quite good cosmic contacts i really like that that'll be the one <laughs> that'll definitely be the one now we don't have many windows over here so i might do this one around here and what we could do is extend this all the way over there although we lost the door i know it ah the door is actually there so that's fine we need an outdoor or outside door by the way and it seems like we have a door in here as well so I might have put that on the wrong way, but that's fine. We can work it like that. I, I think we'll be all right. And I think I'll move these benches as well. But anyway, this is for some other time. I want to do all the basics. And then when we're done, then I'll probably do maybe like a, a speed build on the detailing. And then we, we sort that out. Maybe? I'll see. Let's see how that goes. Now, we have these here. I was thinking about having a hallway in there that it, like in a, an L shape. So we have more rooms in here and maybe something else around here. So that corridor would come through this area, which then means that we need something at the back. We need baby room. We need toilet, we need a master bedroom, and well, what else do we need? We need... Did I forgot anything? Maybe the study or career room? That sounds like a good plan. But for the bedrooms, let's go for the master. Is this the one that we had? No, it's not, but this goes with the layout of the kitchen <laughs> then we have this one during i think this theme from the future looks really good i really like that and i think that's the one that i'll go for color wise we might go with something a little bit darker more i don't know classic i would say and then hmm, let me look at this I want to leave a corridor in the middle, but enough space so it's not like too tight. I think four squares might be all right. I'll do it this way. And then, babe, oh, maybe toilet first. I think that might be. Although, toilet could be exactly where the bedroom is. I'll move this aside for a second. Go for the toilet. Oh, we don't have much money left. And here I was thinking that I would have quite a lot of money. 
So... <laughs> toilet, oh no. And dress the knights. Then... Vanity Reclaim. Yearnings. Vain Glorious. We had this one, right? What's the main difference? Can we do... Have a bathtub on this one? I think that'll be a nice upgrade. And we don't have a mirror. We still have a mirror. Yeah, I think I'll go with this one then. Now, color-wise. I don't want to make like too many colors. We are using the dark colors, the red accent. We could go for this one then, which will have the red on the walls and the dark furniture. So if we go for that, buy it and then shuffle things around a little bit. I'll add this over here and then this one we go all the way over there. Size-wise, I think we are okay with this room. I don't think we have any any problem with the size. Maybe we want to put down like a wardrobe or something like that. But I don't think we'll be able to do everything we want here. Have some furniture or some things that we earn from our careers and everything that happened. But anyway, I think it is what it is. And then at the back here, I want the kids room as well. So I have some quite nice ones in here. I like this one. I, we have just almost 11,000 to spend. So, but we do have the skill room yet to, to, to build. And oh, this is quite nice as well. And then Little Dreamer. Oh, I like this. I think between this one and this one, I like this one better. And then, oh, this is 18 row. It's not for a baby, but you know what? All your favorite things. Maybe I'll go for this one. Because they, they'll grow, right? Although this one looks better. I think I'll still choose this one. And color-wise... Let's choose the red one. And then we buy that room as well. Oh, I should... Red one. That's the one that we are going for, right? Right? <laughs> no, I think it was this one. Yeah, and the red. And then we turn around. Door should be... What is the door for that? Oh, just found it. Over there, yeah, that's a little bit weird. Well, I can shuffle the door and the furniture in there. That's fine. We can have it in there. It's just interesting how we keep going to the side there. Every room is a little, little bit larger. Maybe if I move this... Hold up. Get out of the way, please. So I can see. In here we have... Oh, it might have space in there. So I might just shuffle this around a little bit can we please there we go then we turn that around put it like this so we keep following the same line in there and then if we have enough money we can do a career room which doesn't seem like we can First, because it's too expensive, and second, because we haven't unlocked any of those yet, unfortunately. We have outdoors, do we have like a skill room? Study room? Yes, we do. Oh, so close, so, so close. 
can we? Oh, then I think we have. We need one. It's quite nice to be honest, but I really wanted this one. And we need like doors, a hallway, all that sort of stuff still. Can we work on that? So, room two. They should go all the way over here. Good. And then, hmm. Yeah, we, we really need that. I'd love to have it. Now, how do I get back to the style room? There we go. So close. Can we sell anything in here? We could sell... What is this? Sleek, smooth and impeccably crafted. This integrating cough pot has enough processing power to put high and computers to shame. We need a computer as well. That just reminded me of that. Oh no. Oh, I want to use most of these things. This one... I want to sell it. Sell. What is this? VIP bucket. That's alright. Antique tomes. Mm, countertops. I think I'll sell all of that. We need that money. And then probably I want to use this right now. So I'll do that as well. And let's go back here. See if we have a little bit more money. Which we do. This one has a computer. This one doesn't. So that's a win. And then... Yeah, some good spacing. That's all it has, by the way. This one... I'm really struggling because I, I don't like some of these things. But let's go for... Well, I'll start with the red one. And then we, we go from there. So if I turn this around... Door-wise, we have a door over there, and this will go, I would say, just there, really. And then we should be done. Oh, look at the door for the baby. It's just <laughs> going to the outdoor. That's fantastic. Cool. All right. This is the start. So, and this is the baseline. There are things that I won't change, but... There are things that I will certainly will change, like probably fixing the roof. What is this, by the way? I have no idea what this is. Oh. The Harbinger cabinet. All right. Do we have this? I have no idea what that, that's doing there, but anyway. Oh, there we go. Okay, now I can see it. <laughs> so yeah, I have to paint everything, move furniture, open like doorways and things like that. So I want to do all of that and then I'll be back with you in a minute. Okay, we are back and nowhere near finished or nowhere near everything that I wanted to have in here. So look at the money. We have $2. That is definitely not enough. And I've been pressing the wrong buttons here as well. Let me close all this. I don't need that anymore. But yeah, so uh, we are really far away from everything that we need. I even had to remove a door in here because, well, we didn't... Not a door. We removed the wall because we didn't have money to put a, put a door down. So I think it was a little bit too early. But at least we are ready, I would say. We certainly have baby room. We have our master, we have our shower, we have our dining, kitchen, and living room, and our study where we have computer and all that sort of stuff. Now, this is way too empty. I still want to do a few things in here. Or door, that's... Awful. Take a look at our door. 
this is really bad. Like this is <laughs> missing windows in here ev everywhere. These windows are not the right ones. And yeah, I like I'm really unhappy with this. Didn't have enough money to paint all the corners in here as well. So a few issues. Didn't have money to put like a, a support column, but this corner looks pretty good. <laughs> but I have to survive a little bit with that. Oh, there we go. We have the the roof there. So we need a, another column here to support all of this. But we will have to deal with this for the moment. I guess we will survive. It's just a matter of time, making some more money, and we'll get there. 